What's up, YouTube? Today, as you can see, I finally got a haircut. It's a little different, a little too short right now, but it's going to grow out a little bit, hopefully before champs. But today, I'm going to be talking about champs. Yes, Call of Duty champs. Of course, the big champs, the $1 million prize pool, the big tournament, the tournament of the year, the tournament we all been waiting for. Call of Duty, world champion, something. As you guys know, we're on Face Black. It's me, Study Proofy Sensor. I believe we're the seventh seed going to champs. We have Pool G which consists of us, TCM, Ascentia, and BZ. It's a pretty decent pool, but I'm, I think we're, I have high hopes that we're going to do very well in the pool. We're going to get first, and hopefully, if not at least second. So definitely want to advance to the winner bracket and play whatever team's next. Um, I think we're really prepared. I think we're ready. Um, you know, we've been practicing a lot, a lot off stream. We've been playing a lot. And things are seem to be going our way. We fixed a lot of mistakes. We fixed a lot of stuff that we saw we were doing wrong. We fixed a lot of stuff, you know. Ended up team fighting, you know, Sensor, uh, Study going at it. I going with, at it with Sensor. I'm like, Sensor, are you stupid? Like, we need to do this. And, and then Doug goes like, Apathy, why didn't you listen to me? What are you doing? Like, we need to do this. And I'm like, no, we don't. And the Study's like, what are you talking about, Doug? You're dumbass. Like, you need to do this. And the story goes on and on, you know, we've been fighting and everything because we really want to perform wild champs. We obviously need to fix our mistakes now. Now is the time. And if we don't fix them now, then we can be screwed at champs. So before I go more in depth, I want to talk a little bit about the last two years. Uh, a little bit history kind of thing. It won't take too long of your time. So I went to uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 uh, champs and, you know, I qualified through a league. Ended up playing hours and millions of hours of league play to... To get, you had to get like top eight, and so we qualified through the league. It was me, Complex, Rizma, and Fatalize. Uh, we were a decent team, Team Curse, and we, you know, we were doing pretty well in the pool. We were about to get second in the pool. Unfortunately, we were gonna get first, and then we were about to get second, and we completely choked. Man, it's a long story. You know, worst experience of my life. This this experience kind of motivated me to play more uh, after I quit, and you know, it was just so bad. We'll leave it there. We choked. You know, I didn't win no money. In Black Ops Two champs. Uh, unfortunately as well, I barely put in time in that game. I was so focused in school. I was failing classes due to like putting so much time in the game and I had to like pretty much choose one. And you know, it was just a whole, a whole different story. So I kind of didn't put, I didn't play as much, nearly as much as I played in Ghosts or this game so far. I probably played more in this game, like halfway, we're like halfway through here almost. I played more in this game than I've ever played in Black Ops 2. Like that's how much I'm telling you I barely played that game. So yeah, and you know, that game was irrelevant to me. So then coming into Ghost. Last year we placed fourth. That was an SB. We won the regionals, but going to uh, champs, you know, kind of same thing. We got too, we got too comfortable. You know, we didn't, we didn't fix any, we didn't really fix any mistakes. We didn't go over new strats. We didn't even play that much, and we went to champs. You know, pretty much cocky as hell. I wanted to practice. I wanted to play. But fortunately, we did practice, but nothing like nothing special, nothing too much. Also, we did go to the optic house, and you know, it was just bad because envy. You know, they beat us to knock us out. We were playing for top three. They were a very good team. They were on fire, but we beat them the first time. They beat us the second time to knock us out. And they knew a lot of what we did. You know, they wrote down strats. We went to the Optic Land. They probably were taking down notes. And we were the team to beat. So a lot of teams, uh, you know, learned from us. We played Optic. They learned from us. Not saying they were a bad team at the time, but they, def they definitely, you know, could improve. And, you know, we just helped out a lot of teams and just... It was a mistake, you know, a mistake that we should we should never do again. Like for example, they're doing an optic land right now. They're not. It's not even being streamed. It's against another optic team and TK. And you know, it's 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 really good practice for optic because they're the team to beat right now. So going into champs, you know, this is the year that I put in a lot of time. After a lot of, you know, we won the first event, got 16 at the second event. Uh, they didn't even qualify for playoffs due to a whole a whole mess. So you know, out of all of this, it, it really just eats me alive that you know a fort like all those stuff happen so I really want to perform at this event I want to try my best to win I really want to play my best and I know a lot of you guys probably think we're gonna suck you know we're gonna place top four top eight we're not even gonna get to finals etc etc and I can see why Proofy wasn't on a cruise for the fr was on a cruise we didn't practice for a whole week when we came back from regionals centers banned we could we didn't play we didn't practice SD once this whole month of practice not once like we're literally cold turkey SD you know we're just we're going to go in there, try to play our best, play as a team. You know, we have our old strats a little bit and just try to work with those. But, you know, we didn't play SND at all. On top of that, you know, we didn't play any tournaments with Sensor. We didn't play any tournaments at all. We, we played some tournaments with Proofy and Study. But, you know, it was mainly me and Study playing a little bit together. And all it came down to was us scrimming. So we really only practiced respawn. So our respawn, like I said, we fixed a lot of mistakes in our respawn. 
that's a good thing. You know, we're looking pretty good at respawn. Uh, it all comes down to everybody performing. We pretty much know how to play the game very well. We pretty much understand how to play hardpoint, how to play uplink. Uplink, we're a little, mm, a little, a little rough sometimes. You know, we do stupid things, but we're fixing that. I think when it comes down to crunch time, when it comes to land, when it comes to the really important matches, everybody's gonna think about their play and they're not going to just throw the ball in their base and then they they you know get a two or something from the idiot play so so i'm not going to tell you guys that we're going to win champs i'm not going to sit here and tell you guys we're the best team going into champs i'm not going to bullshit any of that we're probably the two one of the teams with the less practice going to champ with the least practice going to champs you know we're a team that is prepared but unprepared at the same time uh we're a team that's probably gonna either destroy or do okay so a lot of you guys probably have doubts. A lot of you guys trust me and support me, and I really appreciate that. And I'm here telling you guys uh, the practice has been paying off. I've been playing really well as well individually. And on land is my time to shine. On land is where I really just dominate and you know play really well. So I, I'm very excited for champs. I can't wait to play there. And I'm just gonna tell you guys we're gonna go. We're gonna go to champs. We're gonna play our best. We're gonna try our best. We're gonna go as hard as we can. You know we're gonna give it 110 uh, percent. You know we're just gonna. Just do our best, and uh, I really hope that we get to finals. I really hope that maybe somehow we win the event. I think we're really a team to beat. A lot of team are a lot of teams are going to be surprised with the way we're going to be playing, and we're going to catch. I feel like we're going to catch some of the teams teams off guard, and they're going to be like, "What? We're going to take a first map off of them. They're going to take the S and D, and then they're like, damn, we got to go hard. Then they might take a map or two against us, and then we'll just win the last map.' I really don't know. I'm just bullshitting right now, but I'm really prepared, guys." individually and as a team like i said we've been practicing the only thing i'm a little worried about is the s and d but overall i mean we know how to play s and d uh it's it's basically almost every team does the same thing another thing i'm a little bit concerned about is drift drift and s and d is a new map uh i mean i think teams have been playing some wagers maybe individually and they probably individually you know have some skill on it uh but we together played it we played it yesterday 2v2s we you know we ran three teams me with study, me with poofy, me with center, etc., etc. And I won all three, so you know I'm looking pretty good on it. Uh, we understand the basics a little bit, you know. We understand a little spots, stuff like that, but we know nothing too much about it. We really don't have any strats. We're basically gonna go in, say, hey, let's go A, you know, kind of do a basic setup. One go middle, one go left, one go to bomb, stuff like that. And we're just gonna hope for the best. But I feel like that's gonna be a map we're really gonna either. It's going to be a hit or miss. We're either going to do good or we're just going to completely shit the bed and get like 6-1 on it. And teams have been practicing it or playing it and stuff like that. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, this has been my pre-champs vlog and I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I really wanted to talk to you guys and just break down everything. Uh, I'm very excited to leave to champs tomorrow. I'm going to be posting videos every day while I'm there. Have a nice video for you guys tomorrow. I hope you guys tune into that. And I just want to say I love you guys and appreciate the support. Hope to have your support over there. And I hope that you guys really, you know, just root for us. Face Black, I know we're the underdogs. I know we're a team that probably almost everybody's overlooking right now. A team that people probably think we suck. And I'm really going to try my best to prove everyone wrong, including pro players, including other people, including fans, everything, you know. I'm really stri I'm really, <laughs> I got the fire, man. I got the fire lit. It's been lit for about two months now. And I've just been going hard. I've been trying my best. I've... I'm looking good, my team's looking good, and I really hope you guys get to see that as well. Don't forget to watch us on stream. We'll be playing, for, I'm pretty sure we play two matches on Friday. Uh, pool play might be done Friday, if I'm correct. You know, it's three matches. It might be done the first day, so Friday. I hope you guys tune in. We might be, uh, maybe TCM might be main stage. I don't know, I, we might not even get any main stage spotlight. That will be left to the other top teams, because, you know, we're like the seventh seed. But either way, guys, sorry to take your time. I hope you guys liked the video. Don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe to my channel as well. This has been your boy, Apathy, and I'm out. <gasps> oh, no way. Phase Apathy. Where? Oh, Where? Oh, no. Oh, Where? Phase Apathy. Where? <laughs> oh, he's in my game. No, Phase no. Apathy. Yo, he's in my no, game. I can't believe you're Yo. in this game. Yo, he's in my no game. Way, dude, Yo. You. Yo. Uh, oh. Cry, dude. dude, me too. I don't care. It's face apathy, it's, dude. Dude, I need oh, a, I need a, I need, a, I, want, I need to send him a message, man. Face oh apathy, man. Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm just joking, guys. But fasty, I love you, man. Thank you for the support, Andre. man. Face apathy here, man. Let him know, man. LeBron James. LeBron James. About what?